Oh, wow. Welcome to the charge. I'm Sir Franklin, and we're taking to the field today for the next part in our Resident Evil gameplay uh, playthrough. The adventure. We're in with a lot of bugs, and we're trying to figure out where to use some spray to get past them. I'm glad you're here. And if you're not already, consider commenting on this video and telling me what you think about the adventure so far. Thanks for joining. Let's ride. All right. Guys, I have an idea. There's one thing we haven't looked at, because we keep running past it. And it's something that originally I think was pointless, but I wonder if we can use the insecticide spray on it. It is the hole in the wall where all the angry bees came out of. Because that just seems mean and unnecessary and a little, a little pointless unless we could do something here. So, check this out. Let's go! We did it! Now, are all of them dead, or is it just, like, right there? Nope, it was just right there. It was just right there. It was just right there. Oh, God, I went the wrong way. I panicked, and I went the wrong way. Nice. <clears throat> we have to go back out. I wonder if we can use it on the rest of them, though. Let me get my mouse out of the corner. There we go. Nope, that was it. Oh, the rest of them dead? Oh, maybe? Okay, so the rest, they die whenever you leave the room. I don't think we have to worry about them anymore. <clears throat> Alright, now let's see what was over there. That poor guy. Either getting eaten by zombies or get all stung up like him. Yes, the residence key. The red herb, um, I know that that's a good thing to have. I kind of want to wait because I think we can get into this door now. And again, I never know like when we're going to need an item and a space for it. Eh, I guess we have two spaces now. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Let's see what's in here first. What's that? Oh, an ink ribbon. Nice. Okay. There's a door there. Do I hear the shower going? Nope. That's that. Giant plant is crushing the wall. A swarm of angry moths surround it. Your view is blocked by the dense thicket of trees. Sure, sure. <laughs> The shelf is lined with red books. Oh, we have the red book. We have the red book. There's one white book sandwiched in between them. Take it. Um, yeah, sure. Oh, this is just a note. Vey, Vejolt. Vey. I don't know where I got Vey. Characteristics of each UMB chemical are as follows. Oh... Okay, so the V-Jolt is the dark brown. See, we're going to have to go back to that room. But we need the red book. Before we do any of that, and we can save, I know, but I kind of want to see what's in the bathroom. Good sentence. Shelves are lined with various soaps and cosmetics. They're all umbrella brand. No way. Is there anything we need? Do we pull the plug? It's full of dirty water. Pull out the plug? Sure. This game seems to teach us to drain bathtubs, because this is, what, the third time? There's something in the bathtub. Oh, cool. Yeah. It's like a reward. How many defensive items do we have? Okay. Yeah, let's... Yeah, we'll equip, we'll equip the dagger for now. Eh, that's cool. They, they gave us something to work with, which is nice. Um, I do want to save. We did not save last video, and we've made some progress, and we might as well. They're giving us extra ink ribbons, and then we can take these back with us. I wish we had a box, like, to grab our stuff out of. 
<clears throat> okay. But we're not far from... We're not far from the other... Like, from the box that we had, the other save spot, so... Oh, wait, no, we're not where, we, where I thought we were. I forgot. We'll have to go back, grab the red book anyways, so we can put the ink ribbons back at that point. I left the red herb. I know. Yeah, the bugs are gone. We must have fixed everything. Also, this is a side note, but if I'm Chris, I'm shutting these windows. Them being open like that... Unless he's keeping them open and he's like, hey, if I need to make a quick escape, I can just jump out. I don't know. It's tough to say. I don't think pushing the box does anything because we can't push it towards the, um... You know what? Hold on. Hold on. I tell you what. We're going to do this. Let's see if this works. Okay. Okay. There. Oh, that does work. Interesting. Okay. Now we know how to get past the, uh, the plant going both ways. I didn't realize that was an option. Probably should have realized it sooner. That's on me. Uh, let's put you there and no. And then we need the red book. Okay. Man, these puzzles. I love them. Some of them are simple, some of them are a little more involved. Um, they haven't been crazy. Not yet. Watch, I say that, and then we're gonna get a crazy one. Because it's it's kind of a fun balance. You know, you have a balance of, there's a puzzle, but then you have to find the items. And then you get more of that survival horror element, where you have to run around, and you have to dodge zombies. You have to dodge the undead, fight a little bit. It's a healthy balance of a lot of things. Here, it doesn't seem like there's as much a focus on the combat aspect, um, which, you know, is is kind of cool, and it's something unique about this, that you have the combat, but a lot of it is figuring things out. Where do you go next? Where's the puzzle? It's not just shooting zombies. Okay. And then we have that room with all the, like, ingredients and chemicals and stuff. There we go. Oh, you're gonna make me... Alright. <laughs> um, you're the foot. Uh, believe you are arms. And you've got to go here. Sneaky, sneaky. What's in here? <clears throat> There's this one scare in Resident Evil 2, the original, where, like, you know, you open a door and zombies come through. Oh, wow. Chris! Rebecca! It's no use. The roots are in the basement. You can... No! Take that file. It'll tell you how to make the potion to kill this thing. Use it on its roots. Hurry! Oh, so we're Rebecca now. <clears throat> Chris! Is that supposed to happen, or... <clears throat> is it just because... Oh, crap. Oh, no. I don't even know how to get to the basement. Unless we just, like, use it through the hole in the ground. Well, that's not good. Were we supposed to do that? Or could we have done that as Chris? Oh, no. Hmm. There we go. Okay, so... 
we have we have all the info we supposedly need. <clears throat> Yeah, yeah, we already got all that. Okay, so what do we need first? We need, okay, water is, so we need water and red. What is this? Okay, it's the, the nitric acid. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, so. Okay, and then we need water. We need water. Wait, why did I grab that red herb? Oh, do I combine them now? Oh, no kidding. Okay. Okay, now... Um... Okay, so four plus six. Six is yellow. What is yellow? I think it was, yeah, four plus six is yellow, which should be this. Yes. Okay. And then we combine. Nice, 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 nice. Now, um, that equals ten. And then we hold on to ten, and then we need one... So we need water and the yellow now. I'm just following, by the way, these are just the pictures on my phone that I took earlier. I'm just following the uh, puzzle. So we need water and then we need more yellow and then, yes, and then that. Okay, so now we combine these two and now we combine this with that and then we need three what was three three was red okay so then we get one more thing of red and we can find that with that okay and then there's the v-jolt and i put this other stuff back i guess we can't i guess we just have these now <laughs> but what what am I supposed to use this on? Like, where? How do we get to the basement? Was it that way? Maybe we have to run back in. Maybe that gets us killed. Have to hurry, right? Gotcha, so not that way. No? Okay, so at least it's kind of guiding us on where we're supposed to go. Okay, so we do need to go that way. That's good. The basement. Unless we can just, like, pour it down one of those holes in the planks. I don't understand. Or was it... Was it the guard room? Are we supposed to do... Was it this way? Okay, maybe it is. Maybe now we go to the guard room and we just throw this stuff on there. Because I'm not really sure where else we'd go. Okay, okay. I think then we go to the guard room and we handle it there. I'm not really sure what else we could do. So the cool thing is, Rebecca, while this is the first game that came out, uh... <clears throat> like, released in the real, you know, in, like, real time. Um, Resident Evil Zero, chronologically, takes place before this, and Rebecca is the, uh, main character. Oh. Sorry, my eyebrows are a little uneven. <laughs> Feels like one is, like, cocked at an angle. This one. Maybe I'm losing my mind. No, I think it is. Okay, so we gotta go this way. And then... 
go in here. But yeah, so Resident Evil Zero, you know, you probably know about it if you're watching these, you're a Resident Evil fan, but you're on a train, uh, at least at first. I, I don't really know, but you play as Rebecca and then some, some guy. I don't know. But hey, we could always do a playthrough of that too, that'd be fun. Almost there. I really do wonder if we could have done this with Chris if I hadn't have just walked into there. Because it seems like Chris knew what to do. It was just that we didn't. Sorry, that I didn't. Cool. Didn't really show how we did that, but... Like, do we just kind of toss it up? Probably don't need the bottle anymore. Throw it away? Sure. Oh, you threw away all of them. Alright, is there anything in here that we might need? Or do we just go back up to help Chris? Like, this room makes sense now. Okay, yeah. I guess there's nothing else there. What was that? Save Chris using Rebecca. Okay, so maybe we could have used Chris too. I don't know. Is that it? Is it is it done? Oh, no it's not. No it's not. We gotta we gotta fight this thing. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, we're, we're going to save before we fight this because I want different weapons right now. And I also have no idea if it's going to kill us before we figure out how to kill it. So, shout out to Rebecca. <clears throat> Let's go check on her, though, because I wonder if we can, like, you know, use her to help us. Because that'd be great if she could help us fight this thing. So it's weakened. That's the good thing. It's weakened now. Figured out the puzzles. Um, before we go check on her, I just kind of want to get everything that I might need to fight this. Maybe it doesn't even come out of the floorboards anymore now that it's weakened. Uh, that would actually make sense. Okay. A couple things we want to do. Uh, I do want to save, just to be safe. Um, do I want... No, I want to save... I want to save the... Um, what, what am I trying to say here? I want to... <laughs> good lord. I want to save the um, Magnum Rounds. English words. Yeah, I'm on. Yep. Europe. Not, we're not making that mistake where the shark killed us and then we had to do all of that again. Like, get all the items and stuff again. <clears throat> okay. Let's go ahead and put this... Do I have any more? Did we really use all of them? Yikes. Okay, I need to... I need to keep that in mind. The other thing that I want to do here, I don't know if that plant can poison us or not. They put a lot of blue herbs around, so I'm going to grab a blue herb. And they're right here, which kind of makes it easy. Yup. Oh, God. Chris. Chris. There we go. And then let's go check on Rebecca. We haven't seen her in a minute. We saw her... This is our third time to see her. We saw her originally with Richard. We didn't save Richard in time. Whoops. Um, and then we saw her the second time on the piano. And then this has been the third time. It's been good to like have another Stars member who doesn't die immediately. You know? Which way was it? Was it... Yeah, no, 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 no. It was this way. I'm just glad to have the killer bees out of the way. Yeah, I have no idea how to fight the plant. We're just going to have to figure that out. 
But I don't know. If we go and check on Rebecca, is she still going to be there? Can she heal us? Because I know that, like, sometimes he would. Or I think maybe if you saved Richard. I don't know. I think there were actually a few things that you got if you had saved Richard. Um, and I think one of them was Rebecca healing you. Like, her being available to give you free heals. We just didn't get to him fast enough. We got the antidote, we just didn't get to him quickly. One thing that was interesting to me is that we only ran into the snake once. Um, and I don't know if we're going to run into the snake again, because I'm sure we have to go back to the mansion. I don't know... We, if we will, because it seems like a waste to just use it in one room and we can run past it. We don't even have to kill it. Alright, almost there, Rebecca. Almost there. It is just... I, I, I keep saying it, but the size of the map is impressive. Maybe she just chills in here in the meantime. Oh, she's gone. Okay. I guess she's somewhere else. Alright. Well, we tried to check on her. So we have the shotgun. We have a lot of shells. Uh, how much... Eh, we have some handgun ammo, but... We're gonna see. I really... The magnum ammo is really what I want to try and save if we can. I feel like... I know there's some big bad thing that we fight, like, towards the end of the game. Uh, that I feel like we're gonna need as much magnum ammo as possible for. <laughs> Oh, man, we gotta go back through all this. It's my own fault. Wanted to see if we could get some help before we fight the plant thing. It's gonna be a learning experience. If this plant kills us, that's okay. Because we saved, not like we saved right before, and we could just go back. We can run it back, see what happens. The in-between when we're just traveling through all this, it's cool because you get to pay attention to all the details. Kind of adds to the atmosphere a lot and makes it, you know, just creepy. It gives you, like, a sense of... Not even necessarily anxiety, but just, like, you are on guard. Cautious. I would say cautious for sure. Okay. Let's go fight the plant, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> We have one thing to heal. We have one thing against poison. We have plenty of shotgun ammo. Um, we have a little bit of pistol ammo. We'll see what happens. Wait, what? Oh, do I have to go through the double doors now? Who took the book? All right, I guess we go through the double doors to fight it. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Uh, that's what we'll do. Time to lock in. Whoa! Did that poison us? No? Oh! Okay, maybe we... Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Oh. 
There it is. Oh, is that it? Defeat 2042. Okay, cool. Alright. We didn't get poisoned or anything. Apparently just spamming shells is the way to go. Didn't have to use any handgun ammo. We only had to use the med the med spray once. Look at us! What do we have here? Is that blood? Okay, we have a new mansion key. I guess we have to go back into the mansion now. So there is that door where we came through earlier. There are these double doors. Nice! Look at us! Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I'm a little relieved that it wasn't harder than that. Oh god. Chris, you're okay. <laughs> Why'd that scare yeah. me? I think we got to the root of that problem. No! He just made a pun. I'm glad I could help. Phenomenal. Rebecca. Thanks. Chris, this is Richard's radio. A moment ago there was a transmission. Brad's still flying around, but I don't think he heard me. Okay, I'll keep the radio. We have to somehow let Brad know about us. I found a pharmaceutical room. I think I can come up with something useful. I'll be there if you need anything. These captions are not spaced hey, right. I'm glad you were alright. Rebecca, the MVP for that boss fight. Okay, so there's a pharmaceutical room. I guess she's... That means she's in here. Can she heal us for free? I'd really prefer that. Um... Man, we're about to have to go all the way back, aren't we? This room is equipped with all sorts of medical supplies. Perfect. I could pretty much treat any wound. Want me to treat your wounds? Uh, yes. Just in case. Yeah, it's top you? off. Awesome. Thanks. Thanks for picking my arm up and looking at my elbow. Somebody I feel much better. To get a deal. Most of the medical supplies here are from Umbrella. Umbrella? Don't you know? <clears throat> They're only the biggest taxpayers around here. Ooh. They make most of these medicines right here. Homegrown in Raccoon City. Homemade, huh? Interesting. Okay. Okay. Uh, so. We have the mansion key. We can put up the shells. We can put up the the blue herb. Oh, she grabbed the red herb from over there. That was definitely my mistake. I think there was some red herb somewhere else. I just can't remember. Oh, Whisker. hey, Whisker. Chris, you're alive. My words Our exactly. Our friend. Where's Jill? Thought you were with her. Yeah, I know. I know. We got separated. That's sketchy. I see. <laughs> anyway, we better find a way out of here before we turn into zombie food. Got any suggestions, Wesker? We should get a better grip on the situation. <clears throat> there must be areas still to be explored in that other mansion. Chris, I want you to check them out one more time. I'll continue my investigation here. Sure thing. That is the, like, most vague leader ever. What did we just step on? Is he shooting some... Huh, alright. So yeah, we gotta go back to the mansion, and then we can get into more rooms now. <clears throat> I'm trying to remember what rooms we haven't been in. I know there's some on the, uh, first floor for sure. First floor east wing, I want to say. Okay. Man, we got through the residence. That is a good feeling, and it's kind of exciting to get to go back to the main part to get through some of the doors that we couldn't before. So let's put you up. I want to put you up as well. Ah, and then we need... I, I do like to keep something to heal. So those are mixed herbs, but that's not going to heal us all the way. All right, for 
first aid spray. Gotcha, gotcha. It might seem like a lot of saving, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. I cannot believe Chris made that pun. 10 out of 10. Phenomenal. Fantastic. Alright, that's gonna do it for right now, but we got through the residence and it's back to the mansion. Guys, we're getting through it. We found Wesker again, we found Rebecca again. We gotta find Jill later, and I'm sure that Wesker is our pal and there's nothing to worry about with him and how vague and sketchy he is. But that being said, if you're enjoying the videos, leave a comment, leave a like, let me know what you're thinking, and I'd love to hear from you. I really do mean that. I want to thank you for joining the charge today. I will see you on the next battlefield. Till then.